Hello everyone, welcome back to Nigerian View. So guys, the Cold War between Supreme Area Confraternity and Plantsmen in Ocean State, Elisha to be precise, is still very active and they are still bringing people down. So this video that I am about to make is basically a public service announcement. There is something I need to explain to people. But for those that have been following my platform for quite some time now, you will remember when I posted a video explaining how this cult was started. For those of you that don't know how this started, this started about two months ago in a construction site where someone was building a house and some youths went there to ask for community feed. And then there was an argument that led to a fight that someone went down. From there, it was a court war, and right now, as we speak, more than 23 people has went down. So right now, there are few people that are still in that city that are confraternity members, and they are still bringing them down. For example, on the 10th of March, 2022, there was a masquerade show, and this young man that you are currently seeing on your screen was there at the masquerade show that very morning. That is where he made a video. He seems to be really happy during the masquerade show. But in the afternoon of that very day, he was brought down and he is said to be a member of the KK. And just last week here, the man that you are currently seeing on your screen was also brought down close to his shop. This man owns a shop where he sells building materials. So I presumed that he was unable to leave his livelihood because he don't want to go hungry. But at the end of the day, he was brought down very close to his shop just last week. And he is also said to be a member of the KK. The third person was also brought down. So the reason I am making this video is that it will seem that it is obvious that people that are confraternity members to have updates about what is going on in their city. But I have discovered that it is not always like that. Some people in confraternities don't get updates about everything that is going on. So please, if you watch my videos and you know the people that live in that town that belongs to either of these two groups, tell them to leave the town. The world is still very active. There was a peace talk some time ago and the peace talk was broken. Now this young man went down and there are still some people that are in the city of Elisha. Anyway, this is a very short video. It is a public service announcement, like I said, to remind people not to be walking anyhow around Elisha, especially if you belong to either of these two groups that have a clash. Anyway, you're watching Nigerian View.